Education Minister Lisa Thompson is still not clarifying whether students will be taught about issues like gender and same-sex relationships this fall when the progressive conservatives revert to the 1998 sex ed curriculum. Thompson returned to Queen's Park on Thursday after a week of ducking the media and the government's decision to scrap the updated 2015 syllabus in favor of the 20-year-old version. Education Minister Lisa Thompson says Ontario teachers will be familiar with the sex education curriculum that was created in 1998 because they utilized it in 2014, Andrew Francis Wallace, Toronto Star file photo, while the minister tried to avoid reporters by leaving question period early, she was intercepted at an elevator by City News photojournalist Jamie Tamelty. Asked by Tamelty what syllabus teachers would be using this fall, Thompson said, in September, teachers will be using the 2014 curriculum, when it was pointed out that there is no 2014 curriculum, because teachers taught the same syllabus from 1998 until 2014, she replied, teachers are going to be familiar with the curriculum they're using because they utilized it in 2014, article continued below, what we are going to be doing is asking teachers to use the 2014 curriculum as we embark on the most comprehensive consultation this province has ever seen when it comes to education. We made a campaign promise to respect parents and we are going to be doing that, read more, we can't go back. Students, parents and activists rally against sex ed curriculum roll back to Ford Stokes further. Confusion over Tories' sex ed plan stories to begin sex ed consultations in September Unlike the 239-page curriculum introduced in 2015, the 42-page older version does not discuss same-sex relationships, consent, gender, or cyber safety. That's in part because it was introduced before same-sex marriage was legal and prior to the invention of social media or the introduction of Google. Article continued Bell of it also predates the enshrined protections for lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender people. Premier Doug Ford dumped the 2015 curriculum as a sop to the social conservatives who supported him in the March Tory leadership. His opponents of same-sex relationships, gender theory, and abortion rights felt the syllabus introduced when liberal Kathleen Wynne was premier is not age-appropriate, the old version will be taught as the Ford government embarks upon a province-wide consultation on a modernized curriculum. In the legislature earlier, NDP MPP Marit Stiles, Davenport demanded to know, why are we going backwards? Stiles implored Thompson to stand up for all the students and young people she is responsible for and ensure that the 2015 curriculum remain in place, moving us forward, not backward, it is the youth and the children and the students who are calling on you not to revert back to the 1998 curriculum. Dragging the curriculum back to the 1998 version and starting the consultation in September completely fails the kids who are going to be in classrooms this fall, just a few weeks from now, she said, this government is leaving students vulnerable to online bullying and is leaving kids without the language are tools to talk about consent and what a healthy or unhealthy relationship is. Robert Benzie is the star's Queen's Park bureau chief and a reporter covering Ontario politics. Follow him on Twitter, at Robert Benzie.